Good morning, everyone. It is currently, I don't know what time it is. Alexa, what time is it? The time is 9.47 a.m. It's 9.47 a.m. and I am getting ready for work. And now that you guys know what I had been keeping a secret, it is time to start counting down the days. So we are currently, I got to keep asking Alexa, I'm sorry. Alexa, how many days until May 16th? Thursday, May 16th, 2024 is in 20 days. All right, so let's get the days started. We are at day 20, because that's what Alexa said. We're at day 20. I'm getting ready for work. Um, but before I get ready for the surgery, the breast augmentation, they told me I have to get a mammogram. So I'm currently 40 years old. I know I look good to be 40, <laughs> but it's time for me to get a mammogram. So that's what I did um, immediately. I scheduled an appointment for a mammogram and that's what I'm gonna do today. So the best part about my job is that I get to travel all over the state of Maryland for work and um, work in different areas and things like that. So I will be working in the area where I'll be getting my mammogram and I'll be getting it done today. So they told me that I should not wear any lotions, perfumes or deodorants. So I don't have any of that on right now. I don't know how my little boobs are going to get on this tray. I'm like a negative A, but I heard the experience is not what's up. So I'm going to get ready to go to work, do some work and things like that, a couple locations. And my appointment is at 2.45 and maybe I can bring you guys along. Maybe they allow me to record while we're there. Not record while my boob is on the tray, but <laughs> being smashed like a pancake. But yeah, so let's get this process rolling. So we're at day 20. Okay. <laughs> so I can't forget to take my gut health. I want up nutrition. Uh, if you guys want to have that flat fat stomach, you know, you want to get rid of bloating and gas and things like that. This is really good to keep up with that flat stomach. I take this every morning um, on an empty stomach with eight ounces of water and this stuff works really well. Uh, if you want a 20% discount off on your purchase, I heard they also giving away free products. So go to the website and use my code Shika, S-H-I-K-A, and you can get 20% off. And I need to bring my deodorant with me because they definitely say not to wear deodorant and I'm not trying to be musty all day. All right, so let's get this party started. Take my... I think I need to order another bottle. Get this started today. And drink my water. I don't have time to make breakfast today, so I think I'm going to stop by a friend of mine's restaurant. Um, he got like a little breakfast restaurant and won't get me like a simple egg and bacon platter, uh, some egg whites, a little bit of bacon, a little bit of rye toast. So I need to do so much better with my meal preps. I used to be really good at uh, preparing my meal preps for the morning, the afternoon, and for dinner and things like that. But I, I don't know. I'm thinking, you know, as I'm getting older, I have so much going on. I'm doing a lot of things by myself and I just don't have the time anymore. So I'm looking into possibly ordering prepared uh, meal preps so I don't have to constantly like buy things all the time while I'm out um because it can be expensive it can be really expensive even ordering meal preps can be expensive but because the way my schedule is set up I really don't have the time to like cook like I used to so I try to find all kinds of ways to eat right eat healthy you know things like that while I'm out and it can be challenging it can be difficult to find places that serves healthy and delicious food um but yeah, so we're going to go to Lenny's. Um, a friend of mine, I used to work out with him at a, at a gym um, in Owings Mills. And um, I met up with him with my ex a while ago. And he told me that he owned a, a restaurant called Lenny's. He, was, he wanted us to check it out. And ever since then, I've been showing up. <laughs> 
and showing my support um but yeah see if i can get me a little small breakfast platter and then i'm gonna go ahead and start work okay we are here at lenny's and i am starving baby i am It's not packing here today. I don't order nothing else but the traditional breakfast platter. So I asked for egg whites, but yeah. So this is my breakfast for today. Just eggs, bacon, and toast. That's it. By the time I am healed from my surgery, um, I have about six weeks until I can actually do full workout, full body workout. But I've been asking other women that previously had um, top surgery and other competitors, really, not just women, but other competitors. They said some took the six weeks, some took the eight weeks, some took longer um, just because they didn't want to mess their money up. They messed their investment up because uh, if you didn't know, if I didn't mention before, um, my breast surgery was actually $8,500. So... I don't want to mess that up. I don't want to go back to the gym too soon and, you know, mess anything up. So if I feel comfortable enough to go back to the gym, I will. And then I'll start chiseling down and then I start, you know, getting into my prep, um, eating the foods that my coach had gave me um, so I can start chiseling down and things like that. I haven't started chiseling down as of yet because I need the extra skin and fat for the surgery. So I... Um, I'm still on a high protein, high carb diet. Um, that's why I can eat this right now. But when it comes time for prep, it won't be this. <laughs> All right, so I'm here at Radiology, Advanced Radiology, um, so I can get my mammogram. I'm like super tired. Uh, it's been a long day for work. So I'm ready to get this done and go and get it over with. So I go home and take a nap. All right, so I'm done getting my mammogram and it wasn't as bad as everybody make it out to seem, but I don't know if it's because I got little boobies or what, but <laughs> the lady was like, okay, so we're going to have to put all of this in there, but up here is a lot of muscle. So I did not know that I had muscle at the top, like up here. I didn't know. Um... But when she explained it to me, she said, yes. She's like, this down here is my breast. But all up here, all this right here is all muscle. So I really don't be doing chest exercises in the gym at all like that. Like, I just recently started because that's in my workout plan that my trainer gave me. But I didn't even notice that that was all muscle right there. So, yeah, my boob is like down here but my chest muscle is like really sticking out <laughs> so um yeah i need to find me something to eat now i'm starving i'm always hungry i know you guys are like she's always hungry i am starving i eat five times out of the day y'all so i gotta find something to eat um because i forgot my meal preps again i didn't meal prep i need to this weekend so um yeah and then after that try to catch some gym time yeah. <laughs>